Starting with the S2M Center 6.0, we will now be able to specify the bridge overlap for linked part outlines. To show this to you, I'm going to open the machine catalog. I'm going to make sure that a router is selected. Then I'm going to go to the Setup tab, find the Nesting option group, and go to Link Outline Overlap Adjustment. This allows us to specify an adjustment to the bridge that is created between parts. The next feature that I like to show is the ability to use the arrow keys on your keyboard to navigate through the cut patterns after you've optimized the parts list. As you can see, I can push the down arrow to navigate normally, and I can also use the right and left arrow keys to move through the number of sheets that I have available. Another feature is a new NC link that was added to the machine catalog. So let's go to the machine catalog. And this is a chop saw link. To check it out, I'm going to create a new machine. I'm going to call it my chop saw. I'm going to go to the specialized group and select chop saw. When I hit OK, my new machine is created. Now I can go to the NC link dropdown and select Grecon Dimter OptiCut. This NC link is new for the S2M Center version 6.0. And now I would like to say thank you for taking the time to watch this video on the new features of the S2M Center. If you would like more information on the S2M Center, please visit our website at www.screentomachine.com.